Hello, welcome back to my channel, where today I want to go through my five favourite summer go-to outfits. So this first outfit is my favourite outfit that I wear currently, because it is bright orange and my favourite colour is orange. And it's made up of a choker from Cyberdog, with a 3D printed key from Legend of Zelda that my sister gave to me. This really cool Fanta shirt that I got really recently. It's from the H&M Divided sub-brand, which you'll see a lot of in my wardrobe, because they make a lot of clothing that really speaks to me. I then have this really cool belt that I got from Damage Society here in Leicester. I think they have other physical stores but they recently opened here a couple months ago and I absolutely love it in there, it's great. And then my shorts also from Cyberdog, just like the collar. And I just think these shorts are really cool, they're a really interesting style. And I think the cut really suits me and the length really suits me as well. So overall I just absolutely adore this outfit, I think it's so fun and it's really really me. And I really like doing orange makeup too, I feel like it makes my eyes really pop out because I have blue eyes. So I wear this one probably the most out of everything in this video. So the next outfit is the first of the pastel outfits in this video which may be surprising if you see my makeup quite a lot. But in the summer, I tend to wear a little bit more pastels. I don't know, I just get drawn to it a little bit more. And this outfit is made up of a t-shirt that I dyed purple a long time ago for a Twilight Sparkle cosplay. I really like this t-shirt. But it is very, very short, so I tend to wear this t-shirt underneath it from Paul and Bear. And then I often pair it with these shorts from Bershka, which are from the men's section, and I found with Bershka that the men's section is higher in quality than the women's section. I'm not quite sure why, but that's what I found. And I do usually wear a collar with this look, but apparently I didn't put it on today. But I really like this outfit I've been wearing it a little bit more recently because I've got really into wearing purple. I really need to get some more purple makeup so I can match it a little bit better. But this outfit also looks good with blue or white makeup so I can make it work either way. This next outfit is a fully Cyberdog neon outfit. I absolutely adore Cyberdog because they do so much neon stuff and I really like wearing neons. I don't tend to wear neons on camera just because it doesn't show up very well especially if I'm trying to do makeup the lighting looks really weird on my face. But in everyday life I do enjoy wearing a lot of neon clothing. So this outfit is a choker. I really like this. I got this really recently and it matches this t-shirt perfectly. I know they're from the same brand but it's still quite hard to match your collars to your outfits so I'm really happy this one matches. And then these yellow shorts, I don't wear them as much as I should mainly because they're a little bit too tight on me. It's just the style of the short, they're kind of a little bit tight across the hips so hopefully they'll fit better one day but right now they're a little bit awkward to wear especially if I have to drive, I can't really drive in them. But I really like the look of this outfit so I wear them anyway. This next outfit I call my pride outfit because it's blue and pink and I just think it's a very cute an easy outfit to throw on despite having so many chains and collars on it. So this outfit consists of my harness with my wings. I really adore this harness. I think it's so adorable, so cute. Annoyingly, you can't always see the wings because I tend to wear a bag, but when you can, I think it looks really adorable. I also wear this very chunky blue collar. It's my newest collar and I have a little planchette that I put on it just to make it a little bit more spooky. And then the top is from Hellbunny. It's my only Hellbunny shirt because they tend to only really do black t-shirts. But this one's obviously pastel with a little bit of black, so it really suits my style and I really think it goes with quite a lot of things in my wardrobe. And then the trousers are my only pair of jeans. I don't own any other pair of jeans but these ones because I don't really tend to like the fit of jeans but I really like the fit of these. They're high-waisted and then they're boot-cut flares and I just think they suit me really well. They work really well for my height. I just think this outfit's very adorable. It's very good for a sit-down dinner or drinking on a cooler night. So the final outfit is my very comfy outfit. Ever so often I just like something really nice and comfortable that I can wear inside the house when I'm sitting down doing editing a lot in the day. So this outfit is made up of a green t-shirt that I really like, an undershirt with Mickey Mouse on it. I'm a very big fan of Disney so I like having a Disney thing. And then my absolute favourite pair of shorts. They have little evil looking animals on them and I just think they're really cool. I got them from Bershka in the Netherlands. I believe they were a special edition thing because I bought them one day as soon as I saw them and then the next day I went back and they had nothing of this brand at all anymore, which is really sad because I wish I had bought more things from this collection. I bought these shorts and one of the t-shirts, but I would have bought all the t-shirts if I knew they were going to go out of stock quickly. But yes, this is a very comfortable everyday sort of outfit for me. But yes, that is it for this video. If you did enjoy it, please give it a like, comment down below what else you'd like me to do, and subscribe as I'm posting three times a week for the rest of summer, and I'd love to see you again, but until then, bye!